100% clean energy. We are producing a transportable, mobile, clean energy alternative to a carbon emitting diesel generator. Hydrogen fuel cell technology has been around for many years. It's been used in space programs at NASA, uh, but its core function is to generate power without any emissions. In fact, the only emission we create is, is water, uh, demineralized water. What Extreme E have done uh, in collaboration with AFC is, is to work at, on a solution through which the cars can be charged in remote locations without any emissions whatsoever and really provide a world first opportunity to demonstrate an alternative, viable commercial technology to the diesel generator. The process with Extreme E really started nearly 12 months ago and, uh, and since then we've, we've gone through a number of discussions on, on the specification of the system. What, what does Extreme E need that makes the system quite bespoke and, and, and meeting the challenges of, of the race uh, series? The generator that we have is highly flexible in terms of different locations, different climatic conditions and so for Extreme E who really are taking motorsport racing to the, to the extreme um, this is one extreme power generation alternative that creates a viable clean energy solution. For the last couple of weeks we've been commissioning and, and testing the system to make sure it meets all the standards that we've, we've set. Uh, today we, we, we have Extreme E coming to site and inspecting the system, uh, seeing how it works and integrates with, the, with the, the, the race configuration. And then going forward from next week the, the system will be uh, transported to the St Helena where it will be uh, shipped to the first race in Saudi in the first week of April. It's going to obviously travel across the, the globe um, so its robustness needs to be demonstrated in, in transport as well and, and so we've designed all of that into the system so I think we will probably travel further than any other fuel cells travelled uh, on the planet to date.